My name is Paul Jensen, CEO of Halo Maritime Defense Systems, and we stop boats from attacking or even thinking about attacking some of the most critical assets in the world, from Navy bases to nuclear power plants. From the land side, you'll confront layers of security, physical, electronic, and even deadly. But this is not true on the water side. Small craft, fast, maneuverable, readily accessible, difficult to detect, and almost impossible to determine good guy from bad guy, present an enormous, enormously complex security challenge. So our idea is to extend physical security to the water side. First, we use the water as the stopping force. The barrier serves as a physical and psychological deterrent, but then captures the boat and transfers the energy to the surrounding water. Next, we don't fight the environment, we work with it, constantly dissipating the energy of wind wave and currents to avoid stresses that invariably lead to failure. Finally, we use plastics that won't rust or corrode, are eco-friendly, and have been proven over time in marine applications. Thus, a barrier composed of plastic can stop a 7,000-pound boat traveling at over 50 miles an hour in less than half a second. The HALO technology is applicable to every major port and harbor in the world.